Hollywood legend is gone. Actor Kirk Douglas has died at the age of 103. CBS 2's Candace Crone is live on the Hollywood Walk of Fame with more on Douglas's life and his career. Candace? Yeah, Pat fans have been leaving flowers and sharing stories about Kirk Douglas here at his star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame. Uh, he overcame humble and impoverished beginnings, then went on to become a shining star of Hollywood's golden age. Kirk Douglas was one of Hollywood's original tough guys, famous for his dimpled chin and brash character. Maybe I like to be cheap once in a while. Maybe everybody does. The actor was born Isser Danielovich Dimsky in 1916 to poor Russian immigrants. His father was a ragman who hopes his son would become a rabbi, but Douglas chose to use his charisma on camera. I apologize, sir, for not telling you sooner that you're a degenerate, sadistic old man. His distinctive voice and powerful presence typecast him for many a macho role. Douglas also lent his skills to more emotional characters, beginning with one of his most famous roles, the champion. You know I can beat him. In 1960, Douglas helped end Hollywood blacklisting by producing Spartacus and crediting a formerly ostracized screenwriter. He was one of the first actors to start his own company. Harry. The star of more than 80 films, no performance ever earned him an Oscar. Instead, he was given an honorary award. The father of actor Michael Douglas, Kirk Douglas was also an accomplished director and author. In 1981, he received the highest civilian award, the Presidential Medal of Freedom. He survived a helicopter crash in 1991 while two others died. Four years after that, he suffered a stroke but recovered enough to continue to work. Toughness means to persevere, not to be knocked down by some obstacles that come in your path. Yeah, I guess I am tough. Kirk Douglas was a fighter until the end. To the world, he was a legend, a, hum a humanitarian, but to me, my brothers and Joel and Peter, he was simply a dad. And it's another sweet story. As a child, he was uh, known by Izzy, and his great granddaughter received that name in his honor. Live in Hollywood, Candace Crone, CBS 2 News.